All right, overrated uh, relationships. Uh, do I really want to read this one with you? Is here. <laughs> no, no, can you me... come near the microphone and be a I friggin' professional in this unprofessional any... show? I know you're just sitting. Why down here with no are you furniture? wearing moccasins? <laughs> They're my slippers. They're moccasins. Yeah, moccasin slippers. Hiya, hiya, hiya. You got a little Indian blood in you, don't you? I do. I don't. Yes, you do. I have like one. Let me do Sixteen. What do you got? Black feet in you? You get it? (laughs) 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 Nothing. I get nothing on that. That was stupid. You know what? What? Ah, go fuck yourself. Here we go. (laughs) Uh, Relationships. So, uh, sure, they can be good. But are they ever great? <laughs> Every married guy I know reminisces about his days as a single man. Married guys warn single guys not to get into relationships. They warn guys with girlfriends to never under any circumstances get married. This is all true. When you're single, you can do whatever the fuck you want. Whatever you want without first uh, wait a minute. Let me get this closer. Without first filtering your decisions through the desires of a chick who probably doesn't even know what she wants most of the time and is motivated by the worldview of sex in the city. Wow, this person sounds like a real prize. Yeah, but this is true, though. This isn't all women. A lot of women are fucking idiots, just like guys. Wouldn't you say most guys are fucking idiots? I would, actually. And aren't most women, aren't most people fucking idiots? Listen, we're all rapable. But when we're talking... <laughs> All I know is that no one is unrapable. All okay. right, let's continue. Okay, and I am as exotic as a grilled cheese sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> I think that might be an instant classic. Um, there wasn't even tomato in that sandwich, was there? Um, even when the chicks get uh, what they think they want, they u- they're usually still miserable. That's how stupid most of them are. All right, now yeah, now he's he's, he's, this, he's in my school. He's in my quad. I like this guy. Uh, you're never gonna make them happy, so why even try? Uh, not being constrained by a relationship is one of the greatest things of all time. It's a man's world. Uh, women need more. Women need men more than men need women. Most men can thrive alone. Most women can't. He's young. You can tell he's young. He hasn't, he hasn't, like women are still looking at him. He's a fucking idiot is what he is. No, he is. And he's learning. Mm-hmm. I-, I was this guy. Mm-hmm. Then you realize at some point you're old. And women don't care anymore, so you got to grab one and just hang on to them and drag them down with you. <laughs> um, most women can't. Uh, ask any honest bisexual girl, and she'll like you tell you that she wants to end up with a man. Jesus, this guy just keeps – every time I think he's gone as far as he's going to go, he keeps going. I love him. Uh, enjoy being single. Unless you're a total fucking failure of a man, you'll almost always be able to get a girlfriend if you really want one. Realize, yeah, if you're sick, past a certain age, dude, you, there's a certain amount of money you have to be making uh, before, for that to continue to happen. And there's a, there's a fucking sadness to that life that I can't even begin to describe. Uh, realize what a blessing your freedom is and never allow desperation to put you in chains. He's making some good points here. He, he definitely has some issues with women. Some issues but, with women? Uh, he's, but he's, there's a lot of truth in that, Nia. There and, are, and enjoy dying alone, asshole. Hey, hey, hey. Well, listen, well, this is well, basically what you just said was that you're a dumb girl. Why? Because that's what he was attacking. What do you mean? So is, why is, am I, is your world is your world? Oh, we were almost out without an argument. Why? But why am I dumb? Because he's attacking women whose worldview comes from sex in the city. OK, so somehow you got offended by that. First of all, he's not just attacking women whose worldview is sex in the city. He's oh, I think he is. He's attacking all women. Look at read what he said. Again. Oh, I know. He was just he being. He didn't say some women. He, he was just being silly. He was no, just being silly. No. Ah, you're right. So you're right. Fuck that shit. Fuck it. Look, you know. Fuck you. No, his mother never hugged him. He's got issues. He's well, just. Well, that's not our fault. What do you mean? Don't don't drag me into this. I relate to this guy. I'm saying R as women. I'm speaking as women. Well, right why don't you just speak for yourself, you fucking delusional jackass? Who elected you? You did. I'm sitting here, aren't I? Well, you know, I didn't say to represent all women's. I'm not representing all women's, but I think I can say <laughs> with 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 underwear clarity that most smart women who see this would be like, "Oh, fuck yourself, you douche." All right. Well, I'll, also, I'll, can I just make a comment about the whole married versus unmarried thing? The grass is always greener on the other side. Single people who are alone 
look at couples and I, I they get a little twinge of like, oh, that's nice. I wish I had somebody to come home to at night that has my back no matter what. That's what you're missing, you short-sighted moron, is that you've got somebody hey, who's hey. there with you, who's going to take Listen. care of you, who's going to love you and, and protect you and have your back. It's not just about like oh, being with someone just Jesus. to be with someone. <laughs> we got it. Listen. How do you, you? Why can't I respond well, to this person well, you, in the way you, that I want to? Because you, you're you're being mean. This podcast. I'm being this mean. This podcast. This email is ridiculous. This guy's crying out for help. Ugh. Whatever. Fine. Go on. This podcast is not about being mean and taking shots at people who can't defend themselves. <laughs> I thought that's exactly what it was. <laughs> <laughs> Took you long enough to figure that out. Um, all right. No, but th there's 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 a great truth in what he's saying here is that a lot of people just jump in a relationship jump in a relationship jump in a relationship and it's like relationships are fucking difficult yes okay so you better pick the right person or you're going to be fucking miserable so you are better off to be single and lonely rather than just being in some shit to just be in some shit so you got somebody to fucking make brownies with <laughs> that's what he was trying to say. Yeah, that's All right? true, but he didn't say that. He ended up saying that most chicks are going to be miserable anyway, and they all have this stupid worldview. So that's true. Most women are going to be miserable, and they're never going to be fucking happy. And okay? what are you basing this on? You know something? You guys always say a good man is hard to find. That works both fucking ways. I understand well, that. Well, then that's, this is what – well, well, this motherfucker hasn't found the one yet. So he's going, he's going, he's dating so a bunch of... So he's lashing out at, ev at, at everybody because he can't seem to figure out how to make a relationship work. And he can't find the value in the relationship. So automatically, it's not valuable. First of all, the only person lashing out is you right now. Well, you've I'm, I'm, I'm annoyed at this. completely lost your temper. There's a guy here. He, he writes in. He's looking for a little bit of goddamn guidance. No, he wants some advice. Approval. That's what he, he got it. He's fucking hilarious. Um... <laughs> 